Look at this, Ricky. Our chips. Look at that. Awesome. <laughs> There's those pickles. Oh, Dill pickles. Dill pack, no. I need to do some edibles. Try to come come down here a little bit. Get them in you. But well, I don't know. We've got you some gifts here, dude. Well, Rick, catch up. Nice. Nice. Yeah, look at the potato. These it's fucking fun. edibles are awesome. You're doing more drugs. I need to come down. Well, do you want still want all these or what? Is that Moe's? This is King. Yeah, that's just the stuff, Mo. What is that, King Crazy? Moe's fucking bomb. Kamikaze. Kamikaze. Moe's a good little grower. Should he be growing dope, though, and putting it in little jars and labeling it? It's <laughs> legal now, man. What can be better than playing this sound in the middle of a call? Playing it a hundred times in a row. Oh yeah! The Trailer Park Boys collection from Voice Mod. Fatter than Randy's gut. It's full of 22 of your favorite Sunnyvale sounds, including... Ricky, what was that? Go on, Bubbles. Hit him with everything we caught. Listen, just pretend you're on mushrooms, all right? Just go with me. Survival of the fitness, boys. I ain't never been so frisky in my life. You buy our Trailer Park soundboards, you play our sounds in your voice chats, I make a little money, and I keep my glass full. Cheers. Fucking should be rum and coke day, man. Instead of four, what, what's the date gonna be? What's Holy your, fuck. What's your favorite day of the year? 424 is gonna be alcohol day. 424? Yeah. <laughs> we keep, no, we yeah. keep them at the fucking festival for four oh, days. Okay. Then they gotta stay for the alcohol festival, which is maybe two weeks. Jesus <laughs> That's a big commitment. You get them drunk, you keep them drunk, they will fucking... Nobody's going to go to a festival for three weeks. <laughs> Some people. I like it. Yeah, they're called people with no money. Because <laughs> they don't have a fucking job. No, there's going to be, okay, 420, 424 festival of... Uh, and then there's a shuttle express right there where you at. <laughs> Doesn't have a clue how to renovate shit. It's a fucking idiot. I mean, he needs to hire somebody like me or somebody else, I guess. I mean... Once in a while it works out. Like the guy that started tucking chicken, he started fucking in the field. I guess didn't know what the fuck he was doing. Caught a couple chickens, threw a couple spices on him, and look where he is now. He's got like probably a couple hundred restaurants all over the world. You're fucking turned, but yes, yeah, sir. You're gonna thank me for this. Oh, Mr. Lady, I can't drink. Yes, you fucking can, Bubbles. There you go. Hey, don't think about it, Bubbles. Don't think about it. Just do it, buddy. Just do it. Hey, Ricky, can I talk to you? Jacob? For... Not right now. I cannot fucking talk to you. I got a lot of things. I got to sort out my fucking head about all this shit. Boys, just so you're aware, Jake has been shitting green liquid lately. Green fucking liquid. He's an alien, I'm telling you. Keep your head on a swivel around him. Over. What if he is a fucking alien? Like, is it possible we could turn my whole family into fucking aliens? Or... How many times do I got to go through this with you? Just because you look like an alien doesn't mean you're a fucking alien. He's not one. Man. Nothing real good about it. No, it wasn't sure a great day for old. him. Fucking shitty Friday. Shitty Friday. Shitty Friday. No. Welcome to Shitty Friday. Okay, so, okay, maybe Shitty fr Fridays for, no, that doesn't make sense. I was gonna say for people that don't believe in Jesus and shit, what is this weekend? Consider to be just, just a long weekend. Just a long weekend. We party weekend. Drunk. Party week. Well, we usually party this weekend, so. We should have a weekend in order of Shitty Bill called Shitty Friday. Shitty Friday is the weekend of Easter. If for people that don't believe, it's in honor of Shitty Bill and it's called Shitty Friday. Get yeah. fucked up, take as many edibles as you can, preferably these kind. And x lax Lots of booze mm -hmm. and x lax Why x lax Shitty Friday. Oh, and then take, <laughs> finish it off and maybe shit yourself at midnight. <laughs> I'm very excited today. I'm excited because I'm getting a sign. That's right. I'm going to get a neon sign, the best sign going, because a business without a sign is a sign of no business. And Randy wants the business at Randy's reach. It's going to be awesome. You know, when I see a diner with a neon sign, I stop even when I'm not hungry. I'll get a double cheeseburger and onion rings. I don't give a freak. And that's what I'm going to do. Well, uh, you seem to have papered over all of your outlets. Was that uh, your plan from the beginning, or? Well, I just I wanted it to look nice. I, I like the paper well, and I yeah. like the border. You, the way you, the, the border. You, you need to get out your outlets. So do you mind if I have a look around, see if I can find them, cut them open? Sure. Okay. You go right ahead, Roy. I want to make sure that this 
this trailer has got all the proper power. There we go. Well, you're paying all over the hinges and shit. You should have taken them off first. Well, I tried. Like with these ones here, I tried and the, the screws are all stripped so the, the, the friggin' screws wouldn't come up. I, I couldn't get them off for freak's sake. Oh, that's perfect to uh. Ricky. And these are all right. Am I gonna be able to put them back on? Old fish, Ricky. Julian, what's the show I'm hearing about? Trailer Park Boys, the Swearing It show. It's just a mashup of all the best stuff that's on Swearing It, okay? Put into a show. It shouldn't be used on plumbing because it, it, things will leak. It, it may stop it temporarily, but then you could have a bad problem. So this here is totally out of my league. I don't know about all this stuff. So, uh, well, I called Ricky. Ricky knows he had his own renovation company and Ricky knows plumbing. He's good with that and good at demo. And uh, I got this because, you know, I don't have any cash, but. No way! Oh, hey, fuck! Here. Fuck, thank God you're old! Hey, man. Hey, Sorry, hey, buddy. buddy. Fuck! What the fuck are you doing here? Oh, Terry, oh, what's brother? going on, man? Am I ever glad you guys are home? I just. This guy just walked here from the fucking airplane, from the airport. Nice. He flew this time. That was my first fucking time on an airplane. How know? was it? It's absolutely Here, off a chair. fucked him. Sorry, like, yeah, I was really kind of messed up. I never took a plane before. I found out all these new fucking rules. You can't do shit. So airplanes are fucking. What did you do? Cool. Like they said, you can't do that. Well, I had like my drinks ready to go on the plane, my vodka and a thing like that, and they're like, nope, you can't take any of that. Yeah, no, Shampoos, was... creams, all that shit. I have no liquids, fucking. No basically, they strip me down. I take my shoes off. All I got is like a couple shirts and. Oh well, Julian has got lots of extra stuff. Oh yeah. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Bubbles here. Very excited. Bit of an announcement. Uh, my band, Bubbles and the Shit Rockers. We're coming to Europe and the UK this summer, opening for Billy Bob Thornton and the Boxmasters. <laughs> That's really happening. We're gonna be in Prague, Berlin, Amsterdam, London, uh, Glasgow, and Liverpool at the Cavern Club, I might add. <laughs> so check it out, trailerparkboys.com. You can get your tickets there. And I can't wait. I'm very excited. <laughs> Always good to get things on sale if you can, because you know what? Money doesn't go as far as what you think. You gotta keep the budget, so here we go. Just gotta dump it all out. There we go. Oh no. I thought these were gonna all be the same colored wallpaper. It's, it's a whole bunch of, of different colors. What the frig? What can I do with this? Money, 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 money. Is it in your head yet? Yes. I know how to fucking work this, bud. 21, okay. Decent. See, look. Okay, it's, it's not fucking with that. But wait till you get the gold. Gold, 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 gold. So you actually gotta touch the fucking thing? Oh, well, no. Pick it up from far away. There, look, I'm not touching it. Hold it out here. Oh, but you gotta get right over it. But it, no, but it finds stuff what if it's in the ground. ground. Oh, this thing's decent. So All right, we'll pretend the tablecloth is soil. It's gonna fucking stand. It needs to be flat over the. That's the exact. Right there, look. Hope they don't shit on you, Bob. Shit on who? Shit hogs. Big, dirty shit hogs. They're coming, bubbles. They're flying in low. They're swooping down, shitting on people, and dragging them off to the big shit nest. I don't like your April Fool's Neither, man. Tricks. They don't make any sense. Like burning people with lighters? That's not an April Fool's. It's not. It's just dumb. Ricky runs up. I know. April Fool's. Yeah, but after 12 noon, the burn's gone. I know, but you don't it's, get it's it. You don't understand man. what April Fool's is. It's not, it's not, it's not, it's not uh, kick somebody in the face and yell April Fool's at them. Well, it is, because I would never normally do it. So it is kind of a joke. But it's not a it's, trick, Ricky. It's like you're supposed to fool It's not them. tradition. 
the kick or like her. Well, you know what? I'll read more about it tonight. Oh, yeah. Like right. it would be like this. Hey, Ricky. Yeah? Clint Eastwood died. Fuck off. No, I'm showing you the ape like April no. Fools. April oh. Fools. It's not April Fools yet. You can't yeah, do shit like that. That's an example. Fuck, that oil is hot. Definitely didn't go as good as I had hoped, but we did make some popcorn, sort of. Asked them to make me a cheeseburger. An epic cheeseburger. Will you shut the fuck up. Shut up, Randy. This is heavier than I thought. Big taste. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Ah, horse cock. I got paint. I got paint. <laughs> I got so much friggin' paint, I got it all on discount. It was the stuff that people didn't like the colors, and they brought it back, so I got it cheap, cheap. Smokes, let's go. Get ready to heat things up with Ricky Smokes Let's Go Hot Sauce. Made with scotch bonnet peppers and hemp hearts, this smoke-forward sauce will take your taste buds on a thrill ride. It's the perfect addition to any food from a gas station. Rick, you know that feeling you get when you sleep in and you wake up and you see the time and you're like, oh my God, I slept in. You know that feeling? Imagine the feeling you get when you're like, oh, fuck. I recorded me fucking the dog and sent it to work. Fuck, I found him, Julian. Remember, Ricky, he's only a doll, okay? Just I fucking hate him, Julian. Just ignore him. You gotta do this. Now, let's go. You fuck with me, and it's fucking on, I'll tell you that. You guys can talk so much shit all the time. Fuck right. 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 I'll fucking crack any of you. Jamie's crack. fucking kazooed. Oh, Mr. Oh, P. Fucking Fidel Castro. This probably cost about six cents so far. Cover this fucking thing of peanut butter. Roll that shit up in this. There you go, and voila, another fucking bird feed. Hi, this is Terry. Welcome to Calgary Transit, where we'll whip you around the city if you're loaded or not. I can't even finish my donair, I'm so pissed off. So right on, fucking a. Anything of uh, notable interest happened this this week? Like anybody have any like fucking sweet news or something that made them like do like a ow, like a kick, like a ow? Because I would like to hear about it for sure, fuck. Oh my god, Ellen. Man, listen, no joke. You talk a lot of shit, man. You talk a lot of that real shit all the time, man. So I mean, these guys are pro wrestlers, man. Like they ain't they ain't slacking. They expect you to come in like that too. Because if you come in, it's, they're going to tear you up, man. You ain't. You trying to get tore up? So when you go in, you got to come in there. You got to bring it to these guys too. Show them you ain't no joke. That's what you got to do. Well, here, yeah, the fuck up. it. The prince, here. the prince is here. Yeah, man, fuck it, let's that, go. The prince is here. Saying, Seth Rogen is like. He's like, oh no, I, lo I live here. I live, I live in every city in Canada, so I should be the voice of transit. We don't need some guy who lives in fucking New York anyway. Seth Rogen is, is Canadian. Dude, what's up? Hey, now, dude, what are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? Let's go. I'm fucking watching TV. So get your shit and let's go. The show starts in 10 minutes. I'm so fucking tired of this shit. People want to remember G Greaser and Tommy from Wrestle Center. They don't want to remember this fucking nonsense. I should have been able to hold it down and walk him through everything we were doing, but did you see him fucking? But you have the skills and the knowledge. But that's what I don't think I have anymore.
keep on giving her no matter what happens. Like you may be like, oh, I want to fly to space and be an astronaut. And then they're like, nope. Well, then you keep giving her the other way. You know, then maybe you're a pilot. And then maybe if you're not that, you're like, well, at least I service planes, you know? So just like keep going for what you, what you dream of and don't ever quit. They said that you would be here by sunrise. Oh, did I say the sun, da sun up? I meant sun yeah. down. I had to wait for my buddy to get off of work so I could borrow his truck, you know? Okay. And I was a little loaded last night, so I didn't want to be, you know, running the saw when I wasn't like totally, you know. All right. So yeah, I'll get to it. When the tree comes down, you're going to want that little guy like far back, okay, bud? Oh, he will be. Okay, I'll, p I'll just leave her here. A little bit of that <laughs> With Tommy, I, I don't even know what to say. Like, it might be a good idea to start looking at a plan B. What the fuck happened? I, I, I just, I don't know. I don't have an answer for you. I, I can guide people. I can tell them what to do. I can tell them what we need. But I can't fucking go to their house, pick them up, strap them in, handcuff them, and bring them. It's got to happen. This main event got to happen. Your job is on the line. Like this, this is the main event. Like that's what we got all the money on. That's what we're selling the tickets on. My name's on the line. My reputation. So like you know, Tommy got to be there. That's a very antiquated way of looking at things, in my opinion. I'm the guy who's got to walk out there if he don't show up. Not you. It's got to happen. So make it happen. Track them down. I'm hoping to play some more tunes in the background besides Powerage. So if you're a band there, you could just go to uh, giverterry.com and I got my email address, which is giver.terry at gmail and email me some tunes and I'll play them and we, I could like listen to them but I don't want any none of that like like you know I want like like you know like like rock like you know just just so you know my style's not necessarily like the I don't even know the brand it's like it's that guttural there's some drama going on with Troy and me and Chuck and I'm, I'm just getting shit on it's not right I, that's that's literally the business though until we're the guys that are the, the veterans and we're looking after people younger than us. We don't have to continue that cycle, but I mean, it's still there. So where does the cycle end? There's been too many people who have been put in this position and they've, they've eaten shit. I'd, I need to take a stand for people like you and people like me and everybody else who keeps continuously getting shit on in this business because this isn't about me. This is bigger than me. 420 it's right 420 on the nuts here mountain standard time so I got my dude going I'm not gonna lie it's been like a pretty long week I have to say like I just came from a rip on the 10 speed and that felt that felt awesome like I wish I has been doing that a little bit more you know because I could feel like I was getting a little cagey in here, so I highly recommend if you if you want, you know, you should go for a ride. Like, don't get, don't go sucking face with no strangers or nothing. Everything's fucked for me now. Because you thought it was such a smart fucking idea to talk to the booker of the company. Then why was that smart to talk to him, Dwight? It's not. Maybe I acted out a little bit, but you're being ridiculous. How was I supposed to know that was going to be an issue? You cost me thousands of dollars, Dwight! Thousands! The best thing he could have did was keep my fucking name out of your mouth. You cost me money! 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 Money!